Now to the death of a local high school football coach, Derwin Lauderdale. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Sion Rose. And I'm Jonathan Martinez. Lauderdale was killed yesterday in the parking lot of the Seaborn Creeks Sports Complex out in Rosenberg. Tonight we're learning new details about that deadly shooting. Channel 2's Rochelle Turner joins us live at Travis High School where he worked. Rochelle? Jonathan, good evening. Here at Travis High School, as you mentioned, is where Duran Lauderdale worked as a teacher and a high school football coach. Tonight, people are mourning his loss. We did speak to investigators who say that there was tension between him and the suspect, James Hamilton. They also believe that this could have happened anytime the two met face to face. It's all quiet at the Seaborn Creek Sports Complex in Rosenberg, but on Saturday, it was the scene of a homicide investigation. We received 911 phone calls about 1030 in the morning that there was shots fired in the parking lot. Chief Jonathan White says when officers arrived, they found 29-year-old Duran Lauderdale suffering from a gunshot wound. Police say witnesses identified this man as the alleged shooter. The suspect, James Hamilton, ran into the crowd and acted as if he was a spectator and didn't know what had occurred. Derwin was taken to the hospital where he died. Very unfortunate. We found that Derwin Lauderdale was the stepfather to James Hamilton's uh, children, and one of the children were there to actually play football yesterday and unfortunately had to witness this event. Derwin was a first-year teacher and coach at Travis High School in Richmond. He also played football at Bel Air High School in Houston. In a statement, the Travis High School principal says the news has shocked our THS community and has left us heartbroken for his family. I want to make you aware and ask you join me in keeping his family and friends in your thoughts and prayers. A teacher, coach, stepfather and friend gone too soon. And Lauderdale also played football at Southwest Baptist University in Missouri. The school released a statement which reads in part, Derwin had been a member of the Bearcat family for nearly a decade and we will miss him. Our hearts, thoughts and especially prayers go out to Duran's family and to the coaches and players of SBU football. And Hamilton is also facing murder charges and possession of a stolen firearm. This is a story we will continue to to keep you updated on for now reporting live from Richmond I'm Rochelle Turner KPRC Channel 2 News Rochelle thank you